I'll call, hello and welcome, I'm the Emperor and this is Crusader Kings 3, we're down here in the Iranian Intermezzo and we have set a goal to play until the year 1050, we just took, took the papacy and we have made friends with the Pope, right now we're helping a little bit uh, with an ally there and just discussing the great game in chat, we're talking a little bit about long rulership and getting attached to rulers, so YouTube... Let me know down in the comments if you ever got really attached to a, to a ruler or a character in your game. Who is gaming 2020 says Hal. I'm assuming this means hello and he's waving hi to, to, to the YouTube folk. Yes, please show him into the court. By the way, we, have, we still haven't come up with the decision what to do once we reach 1050. What's the next thing? What do we do? More of a mistype, but fair enough. Nah, I'm just gonna pretend you wanted to say hello to YouTube. It's about 100% worse go for our ally. And we're stopping them from sieging this fully down, so this doesn't suddenly switch back. So he can win his war now. I, I really wish our war contribution effect would be higher. Like it's just... It's, I want more incentive to join my allies. I want more of a reason. I want more fun in that. There we go. Now we can disband our army. Victory, victory, victory. We can't appoint a tax collector, but we really don't need one. So we are 62 and we're feeling fine. That's pretty good. I'm going to finish up the current lifestyle, which we have. Up to diplomat. And once we have diplomat, we're going to switch over to learning. And go into the health focus. Independent ruler opinion plus 20. Personal scheme power plus 25%. That's pretty big. That's a lot. Royal Court, what's going on here? Finger bones of of a Shoshana. A magnificent psalter, illuminated manuscript with a sculpted array at dawn. We get the psalter of cuckoldry artifact. Now listen. I know when I'm being taken advantage of. But... Let's get the Psalter of Cuckoldry. <laughs> what the hell is that even? Let's hold court and then we check out the Psalter of Cuckoldry. Balai must be stopped. Malice is not a crime. Oh, fear I shall raise the boy myself. No. Someone will, but I'm not. And always let's have the women have their own language. Okay, so, where's the Psalter of Cuckoldry? Where is it? The Psalter of Cuckoldry. <laughs> Your guy is scarred now? Why sad about that? Scarred is a great trait. The Psalter of Cuckoldry. Passing from Kaku to Cousin, uh, to Cousin throughout the ages, this tome is said to be the finest gift one could give to a spouse. At least the other figures on the cover seem happily married. <laughs> what is this? Okay, it's the, it's the finest gift one can give to a spouse. We're gonna give it to our soulmate. <laughs> we'll not accept. No, I'd rather not have that, thank you. <laughs> Because he's known as the handsome. Okay, and, and Scars might mess it up. Alright. I, 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 don't, I don't think... I don't, I don't think that Scars make you less handsome. If you think of it in an RP point of view. No, 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 no. I don't, no, 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 no. I, uh. Listen, listen. I have some Scars. And I'm very handsome. So... I got proof right here. That ain't, uh, that ain't an issue. Uh, 
All right. Uh, what do we do with that book? I can we we severely overpaid for it. Let's just keep it. We paid for it. I'm gonna keep it. Oh look, another daughter. How many daughters do we have? Definitely more than we have sons because we have exactly one son and everyone else is a daughter. Why well, you got that beard, buddy? Okay, okay, okay. Listen here now. Listen here now. You th you think that I have that beard because I would be looking horrible without that? You might be right, but that's not the point. I have that beard because it improves the handsomeness. I would still be handsome without it. I'm just more handsome with it. Why would I give away my only or very few god given <laughs> inherited <laughs> positive traits there? Ah, uh, your vassal. He is very much. I mean. Let's go. So. Uh, Zergheem, are you still in, in chat? Because if so, I need you to uh, do me a favor, please. <laughs> or anyone, really. But mainly Zergheem. All the respect, it sounds like kids saying his mommy said that he is handsome. Listen, listen. I tell you a secret. Not only my mommy said that. My grandmommy also said that. There's a whole of two women that absolutely said that. Uh-huh. I know it's true. <laughs> um, Sergei, uh, can, can you check for me on, on Etsy or somewhere where we're not going to be scammed or something um, for a, a Jabot? those frilly necktie thingies that uh, old aristocracy and stuff had. I forgot I wanted to buy one. And I want one so I can wear it on stream to underline the handsomeness, you know? So if you if you, if you wanted to go and uh, have a little <laughs> check and look. You're aware what a jabbit is. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. I learned that. The day when I wanted to buy frilly necktie thing. Good evening, historic, and thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. He once accidentally set on a cucumber. It was riveting. Okay, so we're going from first time chat. You know what's better than CK3? More CK3 to I once accidentally set on a cucumber. It was riveting. I mean, okay. No king shaming in this chat. If that's your thing, I hope it was cleaned beforehand. And possibly after. <laughs> oh boy. Takes all sorts. Takes all sorts. And I think we're somewhat... Oh, we're gregarious and content, you know. We're a little bit stubborn, but no one is asking us to sit on a cucumber. Oh, 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 oh another son. Oh, a Hassan. Look at him. He's perfect. Well, not really, but he's something. Uh, let's give him... I click matrilineal now to give Ahsoka a little heart attack. Every time I, I pick a I pick a male heir, I just click that so so she gets a heart attack. <laughs> for, for a tiny second. Get that adrenaline pumping. It's better than caffeine. Wake people up again. <laughs> Uh, right, let's see. Um, beautiful. We, we need traits. Uh, let's go with robust. Let's get some some traits in here. I don't even care for the for the thing. Crusade for Africa. Is he not taking a crusade for Rome? Because he's our friend? Is that what's happening? That's fantastic. That is amazing.
And why does he have almost no support? We'll pledge to defend here. What is this? What is this crusade? What's happening? Buddy. Usually they start out much stronger. And we are like almost a month in the announcement. Like this is... Oh, there we go. There they're coming. So how does that work if he is sitting in Rome? Can I just, like, take him? Does he own, like, a church or something? What's going on? What's happening here? He's living under bush. <laughs> Um, it's a holy bush, I'll have you know. It's the very same one that burned and brought uh, that guy up that mountain so you could talk to God and get those stone tablets written on. It's the exact, exact one. Uh, yeah, just come to the army. I don't care anymore. I have enough good people. I can have a few bad people. I can deal with it. I would like to have a good spy master, please. Thank you. Why is it the holy bush? Because some guy pissed on it like a millennia ago. No, 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 no. Because it was the one that burned. And I got... What's his name? What's his face? The guy that, that wrote those stone... That brought, brought those stone tablets. He didn't wrote them. He, he didn't write them. No, no, no. He didn't write them. Abraham or something? No. <laughs> We should meet and compare skills. Sure. Everyone is happy about learning, talking about hunting. So what? Will they attack Rome? Will they attack us here? Okay, we should we should put a flag here. I don't have enough flags to move around the world anymore. Ah, the guy who got the password to part the sea, huh? <laughs> a bit of a wall hack. I'll we'll stop the villain behind this. I don't care. I wish I could turn the info on these schemes off. Joins the holy war for the Duchy of Makuria as an attacker. The heck is the Duchy of Makuria? What is that? Where is that? And why can't I scroll to the side anymore? What? I'm not going. No. Go away. I think the declining was a bad choice. Like, that hurts your reputation really badly. But I'm not going down here. No thanks. Not as we're looking at a holy war, where we are honestly in not the best shape and position because. They are probably going to attack us here as well, I have a feeling. Then again, they never attacked us in the Byzantine Empire. And we have had this for a long, long, long time. I love it when our vassals just grow the empire. Makes me all giddy. The old cheat code, huh? Yep. Passed down from up high. I can use the restore accolade decision. Hey, it's so easy. Just click the restore accolade decision. You know what? I'm going to click it. Oh, we can make our daughter a shield maiden. Let's go. And let's get her someone. Matrilineal. Alliance power. What can we do here? What do we have? Fecund. Now we want some good traits here. Oh, intelligent. We need some intelligence in our bloodline. We don't really have any. 
Moses went up to the Red Sea like open sesame. I bet. I mean, sesame is a is a really bad password. I think that was exactly what happened, basically. All right, so we got the diplomat unlocked. Now we're going to switch over to the learning lifestyle, and we're going to go for the medicine focus, and we're going to work on whole of body for the rest of our lives. Because that is also like it is in real life. You only have time and the energy to really do something for your health when it's too late. I'm really curious what's going to happen here. Will they attack us in our room? In 11 days, we'll see. That's exactly why I don't work no more. God change the password. <laughs> I mean, in the time, we might have brute forced that thing, right? So I'm definitely not raising my armies here. I can tell you that much. Because they're just going to get overrun and destroyed. We can negotiate an alliance. Let's go. Would be fun though. Where where are we at on Wait, what can I do with the vizier? Mulk the vizier. I can do that. We're going to go with Wait, there's an achievement with this. Let me check that. Sorry, got distracted looking at pretty blouses. What was the mission again? Find a Jabot, please. We're going to Crusade for Jerusalem ARL. You in? <laughs> uh, let me see. I wanted to check in the achievements here. There is one with the Vizier someone. Where is it? Mock them dry. Loot four illustrious tier vizier extravagance modifier from your vizier. I have no idea what that means. Remarkable illustrious. Okay, we have to do this. But we can't. He has it he, he doesn't have that. Okay. Okay, we can't do that. Has no illustrious extravagance modifiers. When does he get them? <laughs> I don't know. Let's swing the scales of power a little bit. Okay, befriended our new Spamashta. Everyone else is pretty much our friend here. Pretty much. Let's go and befriend our... Alama. I really do want to raise my armies here, but I also don't want to. I'm scared. Because I kind of want to just pillage everyone while they're out crusading at home. Uh, at our home. Gain delegated payments. Let's go. Okay, so they're, they're, they're sailing past us. What's in it for me? Sounds dangerous. Well, you, you might find a Pope's hat. <laughs> The friends get with the blessing. Ah, oh, sure. Okay, should we raise all our armies here? Chat. Okay, we, we're going to put it up to chat. Let, let's see. We're going to put it up to chat. Uh, let's, let's have a little poll. Have a little poll. New poll. Question. Should we raise our armies in Rome? Yes. No. And we're going to have it for one minute. Cast your votes. 
Pull pad in. Uh, pull pad and you're in. Nice. See, you just gotta find the right... Just gotta find the right things. Oh, by the way. Uh, we need to start a new goal. I'm, I'm seeing that right now. Let me see. Follower goal. We're at 93 out of 90. Nice. So let's end this goal. And then start a new goal. What should it be? I like to keep them kind of close. So I'm 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 willing. I let, let's let's reach for the stars. Let's let's try a hundred. Let's try for a hundred followers. Let's try this. I'm a little bit scared. I'm gonna press start goal now. Let's go. Bring your friends, bring your kids, bring your spouses. <laughs> bring anyone you know. And uh, the poll says we should not raise our armies in Rome. And we yell in. Okay, if we don't raise our armies in Rome, then we will get a piece of land that contains Acre and a lump sum of 500 gold. <laughs> I mean, that's not a bad deal. Especially if you might also get a pull pan. Wait, so where are they coming? They're coming for this. Honestly, we might still raise our armies in Rome. Now we're going to raise them here. And we're going to send them over. Via ship. <gasps> New dynasty legacy. Oh, by the way, we're going to do a prediction. We're going to do a prediction. Manage predictions. Start prediction. Oh god, we, had, we, haven't, we haven't had one in a long while. Um, will the crusade uh, fail or succeed? The Crusaders shall win. The Crusaders will be pushed. Oh. We'll lose. Submissions period. Okay, you get five minutes to throw in your predictions. Whether or not... The... Crusaders will win this war. Okay. Take a drink. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. And just for the heck of it, they will throw in the head as well. Nice. Okay, so this guy... This guy is a family man. So this is all really badly scattered, but uh, he's a family man. So this guy is going to go for kin. He likes to have them bounteous loins. Our armies are being raised. Let's set our guy to organize the army so we earn some money instead of losing it. Oxus bracelet. You want to gift that to me? I mean... Okay. Court artifacts, let's see. We already have one of those, but now we have two? Okay. Where do we put that? I wish we could see what we're replacing. I think we're going to replace that magnificent goblet here. That's kind of good, but also not so much. The drinking vessel I like because of the health implications. Let's repair some stuff, honestly. At least this thing. I mean, this is better than the goblet for sure. So now we have two of these. <laughs> Let's see. Our troops are jumping up there. Will the crusade fail? Well, at the moment, I think... 10 points versus 500 points. <laughs> All right. Release Echias. 
Never? Never. I will not allow him to leave. Okay, the Crusaders are landing at the shores. We are still raising our armies, but look at that. We have a fully raised army. Everyone ready to go, and we're still earning money. <laughs> the Holy Roman Empire is not joining this crusade. All right, okay. So we're just going to land... Wait a moment. Okay, they're all, all already hired. Oh, okay, okay. So we're gonna land like in Tunis. And then travel south. I think. Oh no no no, we're gonna land down here and travel north. There's less crusaders there. Prediction is still running. Will uh, the crusaders win or lose their crusade? Make a prediction now. We have a gamblesome channel points and possibly win some as well. Let's see, it sounds this sounds like a you problem. Mm. You increase learning by one for three hundred gold. I'll take it. I think the first battle of the crusade is commencing here, and our people are losing Arn. No, 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 no. Our people are winning. And the crusaders down here are fleeing in the direction of where we are going, kinda. Okay. Uh, challenge for artifact, single combat. What is our prowess? 9 versus 16. We'll take it, thank you. And we go with very high and high. I don't care to be injured. Medium and low. Oh, I think that was a bad choice. High and low. Perfect. Let's go with that. And high and medium and knife to hand for sure. And we're victorious and that's done. <laughs> These events, I just like to rush through them. Let's see. The prediction is in. So, 94% say the Crusaders will lose. And 6% say they might win. Let's see. I'll re I'll resolve it once the Crusaders over of course. Right now, it looks like they are losing. The Amir rises for a good point. No, settle it. But I don't care. So will I land here now is the big question. There's a 700-something army. That's not very interesting for us. So maybe we are going to land more in the north because the there's more crusaders coming. Let's go here then. And we should be able to defeat them ourselves, shouldn't we? So we're on land now. We're losing our landing issue here. This is going down, down, down. Eight days left. Seven days left. Five days left. Redoubled effort. Sure, I'll take a little bit of stress. How long? Five days until our malice is done. There we go. And now we're just going to jump on the opportunity to go kill them. <laughs> and maybe it works. We're going to reach one of their armies for sure. And they might reinforce, but by then it's going to be too late for that army. So we killed that army. <laughs> Closer to friendship with us, sure. Uh, I don't like that this is balanced, apparently. I don't know how this could be balanced. Because we're winning pretty hard. Okay, but there are more people coming off the ships. So we're just going to stay here because they're going to have a heavy, heavy malice as they come off the ships. So this is our best option to really beat them into dust. Look at that. 50, 64 advantage. 67 advantage. 71 advantage. 73 advantage. 80 advantage. 
Can we go higher? Yes, please show the Amir in at once. And more troops are running into us. Like we just kind of set up as a as a filter, as an incoming filter, basically. Such a pleasant man. We became friends. Lovely. Okay. Do we have drylands, drylands? Advantage in desert and drylands. So what's our war contribution? 100%. <laughs> what do we get? Uh, prestige would be divided and piety would be divided. Sadly, we don't get any gold out of it if we win this. Where's the rest of these fools? Are we locked at 50%? No, I don't think so. What what are they sieging? I don't know. Couldn't be able to tell you. Oh, oh, oh. No, 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 no. We would be losing hard to that army, so let's move away. Oh, they might catch us. Oh, they might catch us. I would like to be caught closer to our ally, if if at all possible. <laughs> okay, there's some infighting in our army. Lovely. Oh, 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 oh. There's more crusaders in the south. Oh, there's a lot of crusaders all of a sudden. Um, could you guys maybe get over what the heck you're you're dealing with down there? Okay. Some of them are following. So we might not be alone in fighting these up here. Oh, we might be. Oh, okay. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Okay, okay, okay. They're attacking, I think. Blasphemous beliefs, nonsense. Let me show you the arrow in your ways. Not persuaded. All right. Okay, so we're going to catch some of the Crusaders here. Not all. But some. Question is, can we catch more of them? And will the rest of the army help? No, they will not. Oh, God, we're dead. I hate that so much. Where the hell are you guys going? Why are you doing this to us? No! <laughs> oh, no. Why? Why do you walk away? What are you doing? You failed us. How dare you abandon me? That is unacceptable on every single level I can think of. How dare you? No. <laughs> I'm hurting. I've been I've been betrayed before, but this is This is something else. That is not okay. No way, no how. Fine, I'll fight your stupid warrior way then. I'll just stick with the group. Okay, where are you going now? Are you, are you going on ships? The hell are you doing? Are you losing? Okay, they're leaving me alone again. Where are you going? Learning lifestyle experience. A temple will be built or we get 150 gold. Temple costs more. So we're going to let the temple be built. I really should just attach to them. I should just attach, I swear. 
I'm making my life needlessly difficult here. A little bit better. Oh, uncle and vassal. No, that's fine. Okay, the crusaders keep pouring in here. That's nice. And we have a Mashad, another son. Let's make it a Hussein. And then we're just going to attach to these absolute... Okay, to whom even? Who's leading this? We're just going to attach to the biggest thing. In hopes of that being a good choice. <laughs> these are all still hired. No surprises there. Okay, the Crusaders have not taken land yet, except here. But this is a lot closer than it should be. Let's be honest with that. Let's not kid ourselves. I'd like to check my supply situation, please. 10 out of 100. It's not good. There is not a lot of supply out here. Oh, that's actually enough. Could split off resupply. And then try and follow them. Okay, we're just... We, we're definitely going to split off here. Uh, split our army in half. And try and resupply. If we can. Would be nice. So the Crusaders are trying to get stuff now. Oh boy. That was some epic betrayal right there. Oh, please don't walk through where I'm trying to resupply. And we have too many troops sitting here. How does the matrilineal mix with the main person you're playing always being male? Please explain for me. Um, okay, yeah, 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 all right. I get the question. So, depending on your succession type, uh, which for us is male preference, that decides who of your of your kids may inherit and become a ruler so male preference means a male ruler will be preferred if one is available if no males then a female might inherit um what you do with matrilineal actually they don't even really play into each other what you do with matrilineal is um Whoever is going to be the child of that union is going to be part of the woman's dynasty. Generally, uh, it goes with patrilineal. So when you marry a woman, then you are going to... like Their children are going to be of your dynasty. That's how it, how it goes. And only children of your own dynasty are eligible to be your next character, basically. So if you have only daughters and you marry them all off patrilineally, then all their children are going to be of a different dynasty. And then you will lose the game, basically. So if you have daughters and you have no sons that could give you legitimate children of your dynasty, you definitely want to look into getting children, uh, your, your, your daughters married with a matrilineal match. Now, the matrilineal usually reduces the amount of people who want to enter that. Because if they are a ruler, then they want to generate their own heirs. So they don't want to marry a wife that is not going to give them legitimate heirs in their own dynasty. Did I make myself halfway clear? Uh, please ask if I didn't. <laughs> I got a little bit sidetracked in the beginning with the, with the inheritance preference. That does play no part at all. It's literally only about whose family is this child being born into. 
and the default is it's going to be born into the male side of the family. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to send my troops after our allies, slowly but surely, so they can keep on taking supplies as they're split. Into scheme to befriend, we become friends. Lovely, I'll take it. Okay, all of our court is befriended. And this guy is actually pretty darn good, our vizier. I just noticed the best friend icon is a little bit different. It has a halo and it's a little bit brighter, a little bit more blue than the others. That's cute. He's actually really good. Assist ruler is really... Um, yes, you think you understood. Very good. All right. Anatomical studies. Here we go. Let's go into whole of body. Let's become more healthy. Negotiate alliance. Uh, yeah, sure. I accept that. So we had 95% war score against the crusade. The 11% battle lost. That's ours. Because we were abandoned by our faithless allies. That's what happened there. And I will, I, I will hear nothing against it. Exactly what went down. 98%. 100%. Well then, whoever predicted that the Crusaders would lose the Crusade has just won themselves. Well, let's actually win that Crusade first. Who can enforce these demands? The Caliph. Probably. I don't like where our ally is going. They're going places where we might not go. Come on, Caliph. End the Crusade. That, that's dying to 59%. What the hell? How even? How did this go down all of a sudden? What? How are these going down? <laughs> what? I hate when the AI doesn't finish a war. It's It's so weird. Why wouldn't it? What is this? A grandson. Okay. You're intelligent. Let's go for learning focus. Let's be intelligent then. I don't care about setting up a match right now. But why did this go down? Oh. Okay. <laughs> All right. The Crusaders just kind of fled inland and started taking land there. That's interesting. So we're just here to kill a few smaller armies. I think the Crusaders are pretty fractured right now. Like, they don't present any great danger with their armies anymore. So we should be fine running around after them. Just taking them out as we find them. Should be good. Time in the dungeon will change his mind. Usury against unity. Okay, come on. Sounds like something you can work out between yourselves. Increase the unity. Let's be better clan pals. 100% war score wasted for nothing. Are they going to fight the peasant uprising? No. I was hoping they would because then we would have caught them there. But the peasants are not an issue to them. But I think we'll catch at least part of this army now. We can eradicate more Christians here. More Crusaders taken down. It's our war school. 99%. Our contribution, I mean. Not our war school. Okay. And there's more fresh Crusaders coming. More tin boxes to be opened. Tin cans to be... Taken and our wife is pregnant again. Okay. So there was a female Amira, a female queen, 
means that somewhere in, in her succession, there was no boy. There was no eligible male heir. That's why we saw the Amira there. We're just splitting off again. Making sure that our troops cannot take on food. We're just gonna sit here now. Wait for the main host of the army to take care of that. Oh, we're overwhelmed by stress. No, no. Someone will surely support us. What do we have here? Rough gemstones. A child gave us this. We'll destroy it. What claims do we have? On, uh, do we have claims on something good? A knave's apron. Yeah, that's actually good. That's one of ours. But it's a large one. We already have a lot of large stuff. We don't really need that. The prize sword. That's better than our axe. Challenge for artifact. Let's do that. <laughs> I would like the prize sword. You're going to let it go to ruin anyway. It costs us 450 prestige to do so. But we'll do it. And we're going to go with... High, very high. Let's go. High, 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 medium. High, very high. Now we're going to go with no medium. No, no, no. Oh, he won? I lose a single combat. Oh. Darn. Where's the difference? You'll rue the day that you defeated me. Okay, closer to Ram. Fine, okay. Oh, man. Could have gotten a better sword, but we didn't. What's <laughs> happening? We lost the trade wounded. Okay, thanks. Well done. Where do you want... What? Now. What the heck? The Carlings rule Scotland in my game. What? Yeah, I mean... They're a little bit prolific. They get around. Carlings are everywhere. Let's see. Your claims. Prize sword. Uh, steel artifact. Let's go. <laughs> it's the best sword around. Let's try and steal it. Can we? Ah, no, we can't invite anyone. The infidels tasted the wrath of Allah. So be it. Uh, what did we get? 4,760 prestige and 1,100 piety. Okay, let's stand on our army. And let's also finish the prediction. Choose outcome. The Crusaders will lose. Complete prediction. Complete prediction. Yeah, the Crusaders will lose is the correct one. So congratulations for everyone who bet on the Crusaders losing. You got a bunch of channel points just now. There you go. Mm, 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 mm. Our granddaughter was taken prisoner. Ah. That sold some court. Salvation must be achieved through every means. Nonsense. Burn this raving heretic. Let's go. Uh, let's see what. Uh, you shall be honored as the hero you are. Honored frontier hero. 500 gold to him. I mean, he's really good, but every knight will hate us bringing him in, but that's okay. I don't care. We shall all be ban all weapons and settlements. No, nope. we go for open carry permit. The people love it. And I can't think of no country in the world where being allowed to openly carry your weapons wherever you go has ever been a problem. Ever, even once, never. There's nothing wrong with that whatsoever. Oh, look at that. I love it when our vassals are just kind of expanding the realm slowly but surely. Just creeping around there. It's lovely. Lovely to see. The Rabin Empire. Why are we no longer allied with you? Well. 
Unify the house? Nah. Does anyone have any cool claims on these guys? Nah. That's horrible. Horrible claims. You got two ads today for the first time on Twitch. Oh, no. It... Do you get any money for the ads playing? I don't know, honestly. I really don't know. It's... It's sometimes yes, sometimes no. Like, sometimes I get a few cents, I think. Uh, but sometimes... I see that the ads are playing. I see that they're viewers, but sometimes there's nothing. I, I don't quite know. I definitely get money from subscriptions. Like that's about a 50-50 split, I think. That's for everyone on, on, on Twitch, which that's a thing, you know. Uh, but monetizing on YouTube is nearly impossible anyway, so. My game is failing apart. There's an Indian guy ruling Bulgaria. <laughs> I don't know. It sounds like a perfectly normal Crusader Kings 3 game to me. That sounds great. Ransom the mayor. Sure, 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 sure. We should do something about Italy. Holy war for the kingdom of Italy. I mean, a lot of people are going to be joining this. And that's not going to be all of them. That's just basically like... These are pretty much in it. For sure. Like, these are in it. These are definitely in there. Let's diverge our culture first, or, or reform it, because we have... We have the money. And I would like to reform Swords for Hire, because... They are fine -ish, but they are not great. And, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Now comes the big question of, let's look at all these many, many traditions we can have and then figure one out very, 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 very slowly and never really doing it ever. <laughs> um, let's see. Esteem, hospitality. What did I want to take last time? Hill dwellers? Nah. Irrigation experts? Desert agriculture. Has additional bonuses to count. Gardener patient scholars? Tax bonus? Canuts. Canuts line of buildings can be constructed in desert mountain mountain hill. I mean that's pretty cool for us, isn't it? Building construction in desert down. Development growth in desert terrain and drylands terrain. All dynamite there's uh, characters disease resistance goes up. That's pretty good. I think I might take it just for the disease resistance, honestly. That's... That's kind of crazy. Tribal unity. What can we do in regional? Let's check that out first. Fierce independence. More number of knights, which is good for us. Okay, what 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 does chat think? And please let let's not try and go through absolutely everything we can do here. Um, let's try not do that. <laughs> but let's say it's between futuva and irrigation. I'm thinking irrigation experts. But I'm going to give chat a moment and drink a little bit of water while you maybe potentially type up a response here. All right. Irrigation. I think so too. Let's do that. We'll place four uh, swords for hire. Of course, it might have been more sensible to add another one because then we keep swords for hire while we add another one. But no one ever said I'm sensible. <laughs> Feudal taxes are increased. Thanks. Take it. I would really love to attack Italy. Should we chance it? We're only playing for 10 more years on this uh, save. And then we're going to do something new. So I think we're just going to try and uh, force... <laughs> Sadly, that's not possible. Oh, it would only cost 29,000. If it were even possible, which it isn't. So let's go for a holy war of the kingdom of Italy, yeah? Let's, let's, let's do this. And let's get absolutely pushed back. We're gonna get everyone in here.
I mean, there's not a lot of people we can get in here, but we're gonna get all the ones we can. Our house members cost us nothing for some reason? I'm fine with that. Why does it cost us nothing? Are we that cool? Is that it? Just that cool? There are enemy soldiers walking around on our lands. Okay. Let's see if we can halfway safely raise all our troops here. Or if we're gonna get walked over by an enemy host immediately. By a hostile host. That is. God damn, my guy is cool. He deflected a knife and a face that would have killed his wife like it was nothing. Ah, there you go. Do it again. Getting attached. He spoke about this. Nazgul. That's a... Alright. Let's see. Can't we get some interesting alliance out of this? Nah. Might as well go matrilineal then. Oh, a genius. Let's go. Wait, I have more daughters I never married of, don't I? Even have this son here. Let's see. Alliance power. Maria Mosul. Delicate and beautiful. Oh, that's that's such a cute combination. I don't know. Let's see. Let's go with the beautiful one. Looking for allies more than anything. Nazgul. <laughs> not quite. Nazgul. Close. But not quite. So who will be our commander? This guy. And where are... Okay. That's where we need to go. So you can start giving them commands on where to move even before they're fully uh, raised. They're just going to start moving that direction once they are ready and up to scratch. So who are we facing? 23,000. Might be bad for us. We definitely want to keep our army together in the beginning. But we might want to put in... Diamondson 1 demands the imperishal hydrate. Good evening, Diamondson 1, and thank you so much for reminding me I should drink a thing. I shall. Let's put in our commander, our siege commander, uncle. There we go. Oh, wait, uh, we could try and get the Holy Order. We should absolutely do that. And of course, they are raised right there. Why Why would they be raised elsewhere? Let's bring them in. So we see an army of 5,000 coming our way. But that army is not going to be alone, I tell you. There's more coming. Where are we on our fascination? Oh, we are done with mangonels. Oh, no. Oh, 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 lordy. Oh, no, 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 no. So who do we kill? <laughs> we can't kill anyone right now. Uh, I should have switched this. I should have switched this. Ah, well, it's fine. It's not that much of a difference. It's, it's okay. So some of our allies are arriving now. Possibly speeding up our siege. I don't know where they are going. I mean the enemy. I have no idea where they are going.
I don't think they know where they're going either. Will they come and fight us? Luckily, we have one ally here already. Though this is not a super ideal position because this is in the mount in the hills. And since we are attacking here, even though we are currently occupying this, we will be the attacker, not the defender. So they will get the hill advantage. Gift artifact. We become the owner of the Bospo spear. Uh, Pozo spear. Our cousin, the Maharaja, just kind of gives us to this. All right, thank you. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. That's much better than what we got. Because we don't get any knights. Now we get knights. And now we can destroy that thing. <laughs> cool. That was nice of him. Let's call in more house members. Because for some reason it's free. I still don't understand that. Why doesn't it cost us at least renown? Where is everyone, including our allies? Our reinforcements are slowly coming. Our allies are fighting the Byzantines. Some allies are here. How many more are joining here? No one has joined further, so we should have free reign fighting this war. Oh no, we become infirm. This seems to be very common now. I don't remember getting that in old age. Now it just kind of happens every single time I get to a certain age. It's a bit odd. Oh no. I ignored this for too long. <laughs> uh, good aptitude. Let's go. You can be my new tax collector. Let's try and befriend you. Though it won't matter much because we're dead. Soon, soon enough anyway. I have a very special uh, place in my soul for characters with nicknames Strong Arm. I've never even seen that one. Oh, one vassal chose to mess with the wrong noble family of the Byzantine Empire. Rest in peace indeed. I'm scared of the Italian armies. I, I, I will admit this freely. I don't know where they are. They're sneaky like that. Cheap way of winning Harriman's good graces. I don't care. We're 100%. We're I don't... I don't need that. I don't need to give you anything. Just be my friend, damn it. With the full force of autism. I expect you to simply be my friend. Okay. Uh, so they're going there. Okay, We're going to go here. Is that... Oh, uh, that's a hostile army. The reason is that my great-grandfather Arle can be referred with that nickname. Oh, all right. Congrats, I suppose. Let's go with wash our hands so we get iron constitution quicker. So what we're going to do is we're going to station our besiegers here. Pull these guys back a little bit. Split them. And try and... Get at least some of our army fed. Mm, 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 mm. Uh, future is uncertain. Okay, drastic measures. She has the great pox. Successful treatment this time. Okay, okay, our enemy has, has appeared. They will seek battle with us here. Somewhere, I think. Oh, will they? I might. I might. I just might. We lose a few troops here. Oh, actually, we lose a lot of troops there for nothing. We didn't even catch them. Darn. Okay, that was super pointless. That was really bad. Okay, our holy order has arrived. So that's nice. Okay, that was really bad. We lost so many people. For literally nothing. Ok, 
give them a commander. Let's make sure all of these have commanders. So do we take on supplies here? Yes, we do. Oh no, I left this random army standing around there. But they're taking on supplies. Why? How is that possible? Okay, let me test this. Can we take on supplies in enemy territory as long as it isn't a keep? What's going on here? Let's see what happens with the supply su uh, situation next month. Why are you not taking supplies? Ah, okay. You have to be in, in definitely allied territory. Otherwise, you're just going to sit there with your supply as it is. And if it's bad, well, you're kind of... Kind of out of luck there. So why can your great-grandfather be referred to with that nickname? Did he strong-arm someone, or did he have a strong arm? And let's bring our uh, Holy Order close here. To be able to jump in. Quickly. Just bring them right between these two armies. It's no time to be frugal. Yes, it is always the time to be frugal. <laughs> And now we're going to leave this army there, because since we've taken this, this will be able to resupply us. I don't want to be rivals. I shall write to him at once. And we became rivals. Oops. And one of our wives is pregnant again, and we have discovered chronicle of writing. It doesn't matter too much to me, but it's nice anyway. Was around two meters tall and a very big build. Plus, if you may put both your hand flat next to each other, that was the size of only one of his hands. You don't know how small my hands are. <laughs> that that would probably have been even more than that. We are now known as the weak. Good stuff. Good stuff. Why are we known as the weak? Nobody knows. But that's just how it goes. Someone starts with something like that and then it sticks. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Uh, Alright, we're starting something we don't want to start there. Show in the Amir immediately. As the story goes, there were only a few weekends when he didn't get himself into a brawl. Well, that's crazy. So the battle has been uh, started. And my troops are too far away to properly engage here. So we might lose this whole war right there. Let's see how it goes. Still trickling in, but now all of our armies are here and we're getting completely obliterated. Yep, yep, yep. Everything is dying. No winning this one. Got the wrong commander, we got everything wrong. Well, congratulations, Italy. You have defeated my army. I concede this. Where are my allies? <laughs> Can I get another Holy Order? No. So now they're probably gonna hunt us down fairly relentlessly. <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll have to fall back, but I don't I don't think that we will be able to really... ...reconcile here and get this fixed. Let's see. Like, if we attack them, we're obviously winning. We have to wait for our allies to come in. There's nothing for it. 
We're gonna wait in uh, the Argo of Rome because we have a lot of supply element here, so we can easily take on our supplies, no trouble. And we're gonna move this flag right there, and we're gonna raise all here. So, whatever troops you might have left left in the back, we'll just add it to the pile. So our enemy is gonna hunt our ally. They will pray to Allah. Uh, so let's go there. Let's stop the gathering. And we'll try and support them as best we can. Oh, this is not going to be good. At least this time we bring a good commander in. Oh, I think we're getting slaughtered again. Uh, we'll see. Nah, okay, this time we're winning. Better commander. Single combat for an artifact. Okay, sure. Let's go. Look at that lance. High low likelihood. Fool. We are we are victorious. And we're winning this battle, though it's uh that's an iffy one. That is not a good battle for us. Well, the previous one was worse. Certainly. Alright, very good. So now we're just kind of standing around there pointlessly. Let's go siege something. Plus I found a whole bunch of old pictures from while cleaning my grand house to prep the house for all the traditions and all I... Come from an island, and we got old rituals and traditions for my grandmother's funeral. Boy. I mean, everyone has rituals and traditions, don't they? Is that is that an island thing? Is there something about islands that I don't know about with their traditions? Okay, we go... Alright. Sure. Nazilla. Another granddaughter, which... I don't care so much about. Let's see what we can get you matrilineally. From outside the family, ideally. Let's throw you some intelligence here. Traditions that haven't been broken for 400 years. That's long-ass traditions. I agree. Um, I don't like this. Let's move this army north immediately. Okay. Now that ally army is dead. I will not be able to arrive there in time, I don't think. We'll try. Ah, great. Let's bring in all our troops. When you not stay for Farah's sake, the frontier beckons. 99% chance, dutiful sky, and stays in court. I will just go with that. She gives up on her adventuring ambitions. How do we catch these? Don't give me that. I hate it when the right clicking just kind of right clicks things I didn't want to right click. Okay, we caught them off guard a little bit. One of our enemies, our rivals died here. And our daughter fell. We become rivals with the man who slew her. And that... Oh. Can I invite you to court? No. <laughs> I think it's only fair to become rivals with the man who slew your daughter. That's fair. Can't tell me otherwise. There we go. Kill him properly. Nice. Very good. Okay, let's go south. 
and face them there. I like that one of our best commanders, actually our best commander, is a woman. Let's break some generals here. <laughs> you should have become best friends with the man who killed our daughter. Depends on the daughter, right? I mean, Crusader Kings 2, the, the lunatic trait was crazy bad. They would just go on a rampage and start killing everyone in your court. Family, doesn't matter. They just killed everyone. So... At some points, it might have actually been better to lose a child. <laughs> they were relentless. Murder spree does not cover it. Uh, fine, I didn't need it anyway. We sold it to a merchant forever. I'm totally with that. I don't want that. I'll take the money. Train for a tournament. I mean, we're just infirm. What could go wrong? We increase our price by one. <laughs> okay, then. Let's go siege Siena. I mean, this is a holy war for the whole kingdom, I remind you. This is the big one. They have to win this. This little Romanga thing here is all cute and whatnot, but it doesn't matter to us. Us winning this death sentence to Italy. And we might actually manage it before our set end goal of 1050. Question is, will there be another succession before then? I wonder. <laughs> Let's get some tax collectors in here. All of these are my knights. Okay, we're gonna finish this siege, even though the enemy is walking past us here, because we need to f we need to have some some more territory here to win this. We are capped on our war contribution through battles. Oh, not yet actually, but soon we will be. Increase martial. Uh, learning on the job. No, 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 Speak of me favorably. We want the dynasty. We want that renown. We want that prestige. We want people to know who we is. Okay, so now we can go fight them. Let's go. A character has been around the political map for so long that almost every person around has an opinion of 100 for him. Yeah, sometimes you get that. She's no longer our best leader. Oh, she's old now. Wait. It's an even battle? I mean, we have we have reinforcements coming in, but how is that an even battle? Tell me that. I don't I don't understand how that's an even battle. I really like our pheasant uh, feathers on the on the helmets in the Persian Empire. I really like that. You know what tells us that we are a very, very strong, uh, and strong and stable realm? The fact that we have been in this war for three years now and no one even attempted to get at us from the outside or from the inside. Just crickets. We could go to the Grand Tournament in Florence. Florence. Oh, it's 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 uh, twelve o'clock here now. It's midnight. Getting late. I should also ch stop the YouTube recording. And uh, yeah, I think so. So uh, we're done for the YouTube recording here. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, leave a subscription, and maybe join us over on the Twitch at some point. If you're watching on Twitch, we're just gonna keep going there. So bye, YouTube.